Hey guys, I'm going to show you how to make a cool transition in After Effects without any plugins. So you just need After Effects and I show you a couple of examples what we're going to create and I'm going to link everything in the description below. So let's jump into it. So open up After Effects, create a new composition. and create a new layer shape layer and press command R to bring the rulers or control R on windows so we're going to draw a horizontal line in the middle and one on the top and one on the bottom And also, uh, I have a cool website that I can recommend it to you guys if you want to use any colors for your project. I highly recommend this website. I'm going to link in the description below. I use it all the time. So just feel free to go click on explore and you can go through and um, find your favorite color palette. I already, <coughs> I already downloaded one color palette for me. So just take a screenshot and import it to your After Effects. So I'm going to import it my uh, color palette. This is my color palette that I picked. And I'm going to use only three colors for this project. So let's go and draw our shape, it's going to be an um, arrow, okay. Once you have your shape, you're going to go and make a keyframe for the for the first keyframe. So go and click on the stopwatch on the path, and go to 11 frame forward, and you're going to bring the first three vector point somewhere here and the tail of the um, arrow somewhere just next to the screen <clears throat> so go to 23 frames and I made the first three and here like that and select the first and the, and the last keyframes and go to graph editor and hit, hit F9 and basically going to make some nice acceleration for our vectors so go to run 90% a little bit less and for the last keyframe as well so run 90% a little bit less and select the middle one and bring it up to run 1.39 don't need to be perfect but just roughly 1.39 1.40 should be fine and we're going to test our animation looking very fluid and liquidish so I think it's pretty cool like a smooth 
And I'm going to change so that my first arrow will be this color. So we're going to duplicate our animation uh, two times and shift them one frame forward and we're going to recolor the second one just click on the color pick your second color that you picked feel free to pick any different uh, color palette but I'm going to link this color part in the description below as well and let's see our animation how it looks like yeah it looks pretty cool yeah if you want to put some motion blur you can do that so just select your three arrows select uh, motion blur and hit motion blur apply and you can see there is some motion blur if you want to adjust the motion blur just go to composition settings advance and change the shutter angle <coughs> around 30 or a bit lower 20% and the and the blur will be uh, smaller make a ramp preview and even if you can you can delay the two arrows Two frames, it even looks nicer. And this is basically the basics of uh, a cool transition in After Effects. And also, you can create a different shapes. It can be a diagonal shape or just a vertical shape that wipes the screen. But basically, this is the basics. So the last step is rendering. So I will show you what render settings. You should use for this wipe. So go to renders, and we're going to render a PNG sequence. Click on PNG sequence, and pretty much just change channels to RGB plus alpha. And the final step is set your output settings. Hope you guys enjoyed this video, make sure you like and please subscribe for more videos like this. Until then, see you guys next time.